Hello, what we got here today? To tear apart, tear down, destroy whatever. It's a HP docking station. The scene uses a combination of star and flathead, literally. A little bit of luck. Nut on there. Got a nice big old power button. Oops. And you got a uh, deject. Sexy. Let's see what we got for the porch on the back. You have probably seen a few docking stations if you watch your XW Bill. Let's see, we got an internet and phone line. Two USB uh, power connection, which is just hidden. Ugh. Yeah, I'll take you to the floor. This sucks. <laughs> you got the uh, big old printer port, your mouse and keyboard, or whatever the heck these are. Oh, microphone parts in and out. A lock, a monitor part, or some sort. You got VGA port, RGB, and see that's VGA. VGA, RGB. And whatever this is. Now we're going to go ahead and open it. Shut off the screws in the bottom. Blah, 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 blah. Wow, look at that thick metal. It may not look thick on camera, but man, let me tell you. For a simple latching mechanism, that is thick ass metal. Look at that. This is ridiculously thick. I don't even know why you need metal this thick. They're using one of those horrible star screws. Hold everything down, but look. That's just to hold the laptop down. And this is a circuit board. For our power, we got a little DC DC converter here. Here's a little transformer. Well, if I angle the camera right, you could. Little you got the USB chip there. DC to DC converter stuff. Mm, Try not to blur it out. Got a ferrite bead stuck in that little package. Another deep, some more power supply related stuff to go. Isolation. No, it's EMI. Got a little LED there. A uh, uh, plug that's going off to the port there. Expecting where the chips are going to be on the bottom. And that little cable there just goes to the power button. Let's go ahead and unplug that and then flip over the board and see what we can find. Well, I removed the second board and all the ports from this plastic. Did that help because the anybody the shield is all on the bottom. Got the entire bottom shielded so you can't see any special things, little bastards. No, bastard, that's still this is annoying. And a little peek down there. Let's see if I turn the light on. Reveals that there actually is no chips hiding or awaiting. You just say, oh, one single sided load. Huh. Oh, we are. It's just right there. Oh, we actually got a chip here. You got it. That beast there. That's a 2T32 43 LEEA port. Just about to look it up. Some more switching stuff over here. I don't know what the majority of this is. It's a switching. It's annoying. Switching doesn't help solve anything. That's about it. Oh, we yeah, got an interesting thing on uh, A little LED right there. Those two transistors. Oh, I'll show this instead of one of these docking stations. 
Pretty boring, if you ask me. That's the most interesting part in here. Oh, we got little teeny tiny fuses. Little tiny glass fuses, so what if they blow? Your ass is all. Oh, we're searching using coils. Whatever. Okay, let's find out on the top what this teeny tiny board is up here. Oh, far, I know it's a processor board. I really doubt it, though. That's fine. Oh, yes, and the last part was just a little button with a little wire going to an LED. Interesting. Hope you enjoyed this teardown. Thank you for watching. And more to come.